the Russian source of gold. Um, I said, uh, Mise no Naka Niwa Sayuk Ga Chigu Chiguwa Chigu Chigu Hagu No Kutsushita Ya Shimi no Suita Sukato Sugi no Atata Tatsu na Doka Tsume Komareta O Bako ga Tokoro Se Mashi To Narande Ita Na Tenai wa Usu Kurai Usu Gurai Usu Gurai Uh Inside of the store Misa no Naka ni Um They're lined up Narande da Um, they line up overflowingly. They spill over. Uh, tokoro semashi, tokoro semashi to. And, um, the uh, thing that line up is the large boxes. Obako in the boxes is komareta. Sume komareta. In other words, they were packed full of sume komareta. They were packed full of things such as uh, sh shirts, patch shirts, sugino atata. Satsu. Um, stain skirt. Shimi no tsuita sukato. Mismatch socks. Um, and the way they say mismatch is they simply say the left and the right are mismatch. Right. So, sayu ga chigu hagu no kutsushita. Socks are mismatched for the left and the right. And the inside of the store is dim. Usugurai. Tennai is Usugurai. Me o. Me o. Um. Pachi Pachi Sase Nagara Koto Ga Hakata Hanani. Sorry, um, Let's see. Kuzugi Neka Sugi Ru. Um, as I was Pachi Pachi Sase, as I was paying attention, as I was paying That's attention. That's a good guess because meo hikaraseru means to pay attention. Pachi Pachi is the sound of you blinking your eyes, but not like a normal blink. It's like blinking stars out of your eyes or something like that. So here he's blinking so that he can see in the dim um, store. It's hard to see because it's so dim. He has to blink a little bit because outside was quite a bit brighter than the inside of the store. So he needs to have his I, eyes adjust. 
through blinking. I, as I blink to adjust my sight. I approach the Tana. I, I, I get closer to the Tana Ni, which it is like a, um, it's like a hangar place. Hi, rack. Like a show. A rack. Hi. Uh, it was hang with coats. Hi. Koto. It's clothes hanging racks. Racks of clothing, of uh, racks of coats, and sono naka no ichimai o karada ni atte te mita. I try on or I put it up to my body, one of the coat, one among them, sono naka no. Deka sugiru. Too big. Perfect. To. Then. Nan. Nani mono ka. Ni. Kata o sukamareta. Some person, someone. Grabs hold of my arms. Or my shoulder right. money the word kata can mean both shoulder or arms depending well, on context i think it just means shoulder why are you asking because last time i heard you sometime refer to it like during the loose translation you mentioned I, arms it's, it should just be um shoulder. shoulders but i, I the thing I is in this same section, we did have Ude afterwards. He changes where she's um holding him. I was captured on my shoulders, and then she grabs my arm to pull me. Hi. Hi. Here he says, someone grab hold of my shoulder. Furi kaetara. When I look around when i look back hi look back surao shita onna tenshu ga tatte ita there stand a woman store owner with a doing shita a face that was furrow shikame Hi. Sura. Face furrow doing. So it means a woman with a with a grumbly with a frown look. Hi. Um and she said Chichoto Choito Nan no yo die. Hey there. Or wait a minute. What are your intention? What do you want? What do you right. what do you plan? Koreto nita koto arukana. Do you have a coat similar to this one? Koreto orewa. Koto This is to hold. Hi. So it's from Motu. Mochi agete tazineta. I raises the coat as I was holding it. Tazine ta meaning I ask a question. I tazine. Hi. I inquire. Tazine. Um, Dekireba. If possible. Mo shikoshi. A little more. Isana 
小さいのが、one that is smaller。いいんだけど、it would be good。出て、おいき。Go out now. Leave. Leave now with the insinuation before something else would happen. Hi. Oku. Oiki. Furoji daro. You are a wandering child. A vagabond kid. Atashi no. Me wa. Go ma kase nai yo. You cannot trick. You cannot deceive. No, it's not you cannot, but. You cannot. No, it just means. Right? Cannot. Nai not. Go ma kase. Go ma kase ru. Go ma kase nai. Hi. You cannot deceive my eyes. Atashi no me. Onna tenshu wa ore no ude o sukami. The store lady grabs my hand, my arms. Doa e to hipatte ita. She drags and pull. Me towards the door. Chigao yo. No, it's it's not that. Kin wa arute. I have money. Or kane wa arute. Ora, look. Ore wa te no naka no. Koka o charatsu kaseta. I causes, I made the coin jangles. Perfect. I make jangles, the coins, in my hand. Onna. Perfect. Um, do you know what this bolded word is? So. Motsu Otto Gayake ni Sabiki Sabiki. It does end with Biki, but it's Hibiki. Mono Otto Gayake ni Hibiki. What does this mean? Echo Hibiki. Perfect. How about this word? Naru. Hi. What does it mean? Cry out. Can mean to cry out. Hi. To make a noise. Can you read this word for me? Narasu. To make. To make something cries out. Hi. So, um, like with naru right here, it says haga, gachi gachi to naru. So right here, it's not an animal crying out. It is the sound specifically occurring, like otogasuru is another way that naru can mean. So narasu <laughs> is that same idea, but with o. And um, what's this bolded word right here? Hibikase. Perfect. Let's go read this line from the book. Hi. Onna tenshu ga tachi domaru. Mata. Koka o. Narashita ra. Usugurai. Tenai ni. Sono. 
大きく響いた。止まる is from 止まる、はい、to stop. 立ち stand. The store lady came to a standing still, basically.、はい、She is standing still. Yep, because tatsu in Japanese does not intend you stillness, unlike the word in English. It just means on your feet. So she stopped on her feet. Stop on her feet. Wakata. Mata Koka o Narashitara. Once again,、mm. when I make noise, the coins. Yeah, make noise with the coins. Noise with the coin. Inside of the dim store, Gurai Usu Gurai Ten Naini Sono Oto Ga, that sound Okiku loudly echoes. He beat up. Perfect. Amira Unazuka means Unazui. I shake my head. It is a kind of shaking. Is it a left to right shaking or a up to down shaking? I sh left and right shake my head. That's a good、shake、guess. It is、back. not. To shake your head left and right would be kubi o futa. I see. So I nodded in agreement.、Right. Yep, unazuite means to nod. So in this context, it says,、um, I, I nodded as a sign to show I'm definitely listening. Unazuite. Chanto. Chanto kite de yo.、Um, let's go read the line from the book. Onna tenshu wa. Unazuita Ma Kanega Aru Nara Isa. The store lady nodded in agreement. She said, Well, if there is Gaaru Nara Isa, then it is good. It's good then, she said. Isa.、Yeah. If you have money, then it's good. That's our naughty one. Fine. You can go look in my store. You know what sagasu means? Sagasu is to search. Hi. Do you know what this folded word is? It is boshi. Perfect. So we saw this kanji earlier. Do you know how to read it? Sagasu. Perfect. Search. You know what hito tsuzutsu means? Hito tsuzutsu. I forgot money. One of、right. something. It does have one of something. You're correct. Zutsu means like bit. So hito tsuzutsu means one by one. I guess it's by actually, <laughs> or bit by bit if you're said skoshi zutsu.、Um, so、it's、uh, by is the zutsu part. He told,、uh, so here it's specifically saying that there's nothing I can do except for hold each item, each bag in both hands, each one per hand, basically, one at a time in each hand.、Um, what is the te form of to search? Searching, searchily. Sagasu. Now it's saga. De. That's saga a good guess. Sagashi, shite. 
Yeah. Uh, what's that bolded word up here? Atsute. Hi, atsude. Can you read this example sentence for me? Atsude no koto to shimi ga tsukanai boshi o hitotsu zutsu sagashita. I search. One by one, for a hat without stain, Simiga Swin Kanai. Uh, and a thick coat. Atsude no photo. Do you know what a zubon is? Zubon is a pant. Perfect. Like a boy pants. What does ao mean with that kanji up here? Ao. Uh, awaseta. To fit. But here is in the causative. So mm. I made it. Okay. It can have meaning to fit. Specifically, it means to match. Which. Seems like a small difference, like to point out, um, since if something fits your outfit, uh, if your outfit fits and it matches kind of idea. But right over here, it's basically saying if you took all of these guys and forced them to combine together into one thing, then he's hungry. But ow in general, general means like to match, like to suit you, for example, like, oh, that outfit matches or to things like that. Um, match. So um so in here uh, it's match like the suit like oh this the outfit matches satsuni au zubo o kata i bought a matching pants and shirt like a pants that matches the shirt Yes, I bought pants that matches just shirt. Perfect. Do you know what a mafura is? Mafura. A muffler. That's a that might be right. Um yeah, a scarf. Is that what a mafura? Mafura? Oh, oh you're right. A mafura is scarf. I heard it once before. Um can you read this word for me? It means wool. Mo and then ito. Good guess. It's ke and then ito. You're right, that is mo from mo foot. That's ke ito. Um, so, what does ke ito mean? It means wool. Perfect. Um, can you read this example such as for me? Ke ito no mafura o sagashite kita. I came to search for a scarf of wool, okay. for a woolen scarf. And the kita here would insinuate he found the object as well. I I came looking for this item and I found it as well. It's kind of what it insinuates. Okay. Kita means it has achieved. Right. So let's go read the line from the book. So she did. no zubon to kutsu shita. And then a thick pants and socks. De ka sugiru koto ni au. A, a shirt a shirt matches with a thick coat uh, if oh, possible. De, de
Oh, large. Nice. But why did he say Sugiru as in like it too large? Fit. Yeah, it's a little bit too big. Should be a little bit smaller, but looks like they didn't have um, a smaller coat in stock. Well, he can grow uh, into match, it. He's a little big. He wants something a little big. Um, ke ito no makura scarf made of wool oh. and so he he lists he had a exhaustive list of what he wanted he listed oh, them all hi. he did not um boshio itotsu dutsu sagashite kita and I found one by one hat. Why did he say this? Mm -hmm. That he came to score or did he found it? So, so he sagasu, he, he looked and found. I came to find, basically. Um, and the idea is I that. Came to did he find all these items at once? Were they all in like the same location, just present out, right for him to look at? Or do you think he had to go look for them in certain areas? Like, oh, I'm going to go over and look at the pants. I'm going to look in the pants for a pair that might fit me. Oh, now i got to go look at the socks. Now I'm going to go look at the shirt. How do you think he looked um, for stuff? I think that he found them one by one in I... different locations, in different boxes. Um, so he hot he searched them out one at a time, exactly. And he came to town, hat and scarf of wool and shirt that matches the slightly large coat, or I mean, not slightly but the large coat. Uh, and he found the socks along with the pants, right? Thick pants. Yep. Perfect. And the wool scarf. Um, what's the potential form of to walk? To be able to walk. Araku. Araku. Aruku. 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 Was it Oliver Oliver Twist or something? Uh, what was the story about children that was poor during the sort of the early industrial era in England? I I mean, no was idea. it Oliver? Like the children's story, you know, it was pretty popular. Right. I feel like this book is it mm -hmm. feels a lot like like yeah. the Old, definitely inspired Korean right. era you have lots of very poor children working in the factories yes it is set in that it time period well same as like Sherlock Holmes right. you know the same kind of time period as that right though they don't seem to really I mean they don't really have cars yet there are still at the horse wrong carriages right but they started to be industrialized, you know, where they oh, start cool. to have. It's not medieval, but it's not modern either. It's so, so. somewhere in between. Right. Good. So here in potential form. Um, potential. So. Potential, so aru kaseru? No, no. Aru kareru. It does end with the noon, but a ne do is something called passive. And passive yeah. and potential form are identical for do verbs, but they're actually quite different for u verbs. They do not have a a. So we don't have the a. 
So what happened to the ku here? It changes to ka, aru ka. That's a good guess, but there's no a. Ah, I just told you. So that it that is the worst thing you could have guessed. Since there's no a ah sound, I... you can't add a ah to k to make ka. So what happened to the ku here? It's drop. It does actually ah, k to k sound. Aru. Aruke? Be able to walk. Okay, I think I'm a problem with this. We don't see potential form that often, but potential form is eru. Eru. What's the potential form of yomu? Yomu. So here is another u type verb. So it's meru. Yo meru. Hi, yo meru. Perfect. Um, do you know what ganjo means? Ganjo. Na. Table. I think scratch. Good guess. Um, it oh, means scratch. um <laughs> solid. Scratch is here, but kizu ga tsuita. It's a solid or sturdy. Table. Ganjo. Ganjo. The jo part here is the same oh. jo from daijoubu. Hi. Ganjo is sturdy. Can I Can you say that again? Jo in kanji. Hi. Can I see the word jo in kanji? Ganjo. Here's the kanji. That doesn't look right, kanjo. Oh, no wonder I, I did kangan jo. There we go. Here's um, dai jo. Jo. Well, jo bu. Help me type the word gambate, but in kanji, if they have it. Yep. Um, I see Same it does gun. have him. So it's gone as in like make an effort or to be sturdy. Right. Well, jo so also means sturdy. Like daijoubu means you're. I, are you sturdy? <laughs> I'm sturdy. But they, if they say gamba, gambate or gambare, they mean to say strengthen yourself up. Yeah, stick on that make strength. Effort. And here it's a ganjo as in this thing is sturdy and it's okay as in daijobu. <laughs> jo jobu means um, robust. Um, robust. Not to die on it. So this is like the sturdiness and this is like the power. So it's, it's sturdy and powerful. I guess. So it's ganjo. very sturdy. Um, let's go See, I made that connection. It's smart to make those connections. It makes remembering the word a lot easier. Right. Ore wa kutsu mo sagashite yo. Mm, I also look for sh shoes, he say. Hi. In this case, uh, it's kind of weird, but he's kind of talking to himself here. Um, it's written in a weird way. Hi. I said, it's kind of like I said to myself, oh. I should find shoes. I will find shoes she as well. It's a yo. Hi. Yo. Yo had the insinuation of let's. He, he reminded him. He reminded him. Yeah. Of, and Te oh, is a oh, order, oh. right? He's ordering himself to do this. Hi. What in the... I make the sound? Mm -hmm. That's a really good guess, but this is one word right here. Hence the comma here, not the period. So it says, I said, I let out a voice saying, um, find 
shoes as well. Um, and the yo of making this feel more like should. Gotta find shoes too. Is uh, I said I said to myself basically. Yeah, kaketa, koe o kaketa. I made a I made a sound. Hayaku ara keru. Ara keru. Aru. Hayaku ara keru. Aru aru keru. Hayaku aru keru. Ganjo na putsu ga i. A shoes, it a, sh a shoe that is sturdy and quick to walk. What is, is that the potential mean? form? Of? What do you think it is? What is it to walk is on the its potential own? form? Hi, Aru Keru. Eru. Hi, Aru Keru. To be able to walk quickly. Yes. So he looked for shoes Possible that to walk make him, him allow him to walk fast and are sturdy. Those would be E. And sturdy. That is good. Okay. That would be E. You know what okureru means? Okureru. Okureru? That oku is to do something, to play something. I just told you this verb was okureru. So why would you take off the ru and turn it into oku? Oh, uh, okureru. What is this word? Hi. I don't want to say. Hi. It could also be okureru. You could do that as well. Um. Okuru, okuru. They're they're very similar verbs. Um, they both mean to be late. Um, oru wa okurenai yoni ni karuku hashite um tsuiteita. In order to not be late, I um ran. I lightly ran after them. Oru o okureru okurenai. Um, to be late. Okuru is to be late. Right. So okuru, okuru is late. So yeah, I said is okuru, a, is... so I'm sorry. Okuru is to send. So okureru is the one that means. Okuru. Okureru. Be late. Is that a passive verb, Moni? Mm, I guess. You're not making Got... someone else be late. Does it take... So, okureru, the reru being passive. Hi. Sure. The um, it's not conjugated in any way other than negative form. Um, Hi. Let's go read this line from the book. So, sureda, nebari ni okurezu ni suite ikeru. Ike from Ike. Hi. But potential form. Ikeru. So, okureru, not only meaning late, can also mean to fall behind. So, fall behind might be a better way to translate it in this specific sentence. Okurezu ni. Without falling behind, nebari. Nebari ni okurezu ni. Without falling behind, nebari. Suite follow. From suku. Ikeru. It's to iku. It's from It's iku possible to go. Plus eru. Hi. So he making um. Making a comment here on his previous sentence, he's sore ba. Right. 
。If、I、そうすれば。そうすれば。consider。So if that was so。If I was to do that。That is so。If I was to do that。Then I would be able to keep up。いける。So it's there, right? I keep it up with him. I attaching、right. myself to him. It's、without、possible for me、behind. to do so. Perfect. Without falling. Can you read this kanji right here? Here it says sagashite. Sagashite. Hi. And what does owl mean? Owl is a match. Perfect. Or a fit. What is the passive form of you? Not potential, passive. This is an u type. And we want a passive conjugation. So, e, wa, re, ru. Perfect. We want it to be told.、At Um, ne giru with kiru to cut is to haggle, like the cut your price down. Ne giru is also a u verb, so r plus u. What is the te form of ne giru to haggle? Te form of ne giru. r verb go down. ねぎるこだん。てぽん。ねぎって。Perfect. So if you look at here at ねぎる the very first kanji is the same kanji in ねだん。ねだん is the price of an object, the cost of an object. ねだんはねる、ねぎる to haggle. So, negiru, in other words, means to cut the cost of a product. And this right here is the cost in general. Nedan.、Um, can we read this line from the book? Onna tenshu ga nedan o itta. The store lady stayed the price. She spoke the price. Exactly. But netto ni hayaku shiro to iware te itta kara negiru jikan. はない。There's no time. ねぎる。To haggle. To negotiate the price. はい。Why is there no time to haggle? We have から coming after a た form of a verb. That means that this is an end of a clause.、Hi. So the kara means because he heard, he,、uh, he was spoken to. Hi. He was told.、Uh, it was some, someone told him that he n e e d oh, that someone is. Ne- Benet. Benet told. I was told by Benet. Benet told me that Hayaku Shiro t o Hurry up. Do it quick. Hayaku Shiro. Therefore, Kara. Since, since because of this, Nigeru Chikan wa nai. I don't have time to haggle. Perfect. Can you read this word for me? Kaeru. The first kanji is to arrive. It can mean to, to arrive. 
And it is to put on this contact. So the word to put on is. Ki I don't remember the word to. From Kiru. 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 So oh. ki, ki gaeru. Right. Ki gaeru is a verb, which means to change your clothes. Ki gaeru. Well, uh, kiru yeah? is kiru is to put on and kiku is to write. Um, I'm not sure what. Yes, um, kiku does mean to write. Um, kiru uh, has lots of kirus. There's kiru to cut, for example, which is glottal stop kiru, right? Kitet. Um, this kiru, which is to ride, is kitet, right? Um, without the glottal stop. That's a verb. Ichidon. That's why it's kigairu and not kirigairu, uh, right? Which kiri would turn into kiri if it was in the front position. Which I don't think it ever is. It's always an ending helping verb. Yeah. Kiru to right. change your clothes. Specifically, kiru is supposed to refer to like shirts and stuff. But with kigairu it refers to your whole assemble, of course. Um, it's kind of like the generic-ish um, changing clothes, but it does focus on um, the top half of your body. But for example, we have seen kaburu for hats and hōru for cloaks uh, in the book so far. Um, what is the te form of this verb? Te form. Kigairu. He got edit to form. We say that this root was a root type, Ronnie, or is it a root type? It is a root verb. Root. So it's itidan. He got e te. Just normal te, no glottal stop. He got e te. Yep. Let's go read this example sentence. Boro. We say that kigaeta was to come to be infinite. What's the meaning of kigaeta again, Mommy? Hi. So kiru, kiru is to wear clothes. Kaeru is to change. What do you think kigairu means? To change new clothes. Hi, hi, to change into clothes. So altogether, what does this Ki sentence say? Fukuni. Atsude no fukuni. Boro fuku kara. Boro is what is boro, mommy? Hi, boro comes from boro boro, which means to be in bad condition, to be kind of old. I change out of bad clothes into thick clothes. Perfect. Atsude no fukuni. Right. Our next word is shimeru, which is also a ru verb. Shimeru means to tie. Can you read this word? Shimeru. This is kutsu himo. What do you think is a kutsu himo? This is shoestrings. Exactly. Kutsu. Shoes. Shimeru. Shime is the same form of the word. Hi. Is this a ru verb? Yes, shimeru to tie is a ru verb. Can you read this word for me? Hi. No. Tenshu wa kutsu himo o shimeta. Shimeta. I tied the shoestrings. Hi, who tied the shoestrings? Oh, no. The store owner. Hi. Perfect. 
Right. Um, what does harau mean in this context? Harau. Harau. Is to buy. No, mm -hmm. kao is to buy. Right. Harau. Harau. Kane o harau. Ah, I clear the, I pay the money, I pay it. Hi, hi, to pay, exactly. I paid the cost to the shujin. Um, uh, this one here was supposed to be pink, but right now it's white. What does yurumeru mean? Yurumeru. Yurumeru. Kuchimoto. Oh, you met it. Waving? Good guess. It is no, similar it's... to waving, but it's not um waving. It's also it's it's not a totally different kanji, but it does sound similar to rocking. But you do is to loosen. Nebody, he also seems to have love to this mansion. Um and the his lips loosen basically, the area around his mouth. Um, loosen a little slight smile. You do so, me. Do. You do me. That's the kanji there, right, Moni? Right. You? So, you do madu and you do medu are the same word, except for you do medu takes o. Oh, what do you think you do madu means? Takes. Kiru. You do madu take ga. Perfect. So, so you can use bakari to mean just. You've mentioned this before, like you had this vaguely in your memory, but it's the first time we've officially got to see this in the book. So when bakari is used to mean like right after an action occurred, kind of like a toe in past tense, it goes right after um, past tense form of a verb. So shimeru means to tie. So shimeta bakari means right after I tied. Or just after I tied. Can you read this example sentence for me? Hi. Um, shimeta bakari kutsu himo wa yuru mata. I loosened the shoe tie after I tied it. Hi. Right after my I tied it, the skew string was yurumeta with a ga. Can you try translating this again for me? Right after I tied, the shoe string was loosened. Hi, exactly. It was perfect. So here we have three words. Um, for you to tell me how to read them and what they mean. Three. 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 Arigane. Arigane. O tori da shi. Do a no. Jo is a lock. My. And then to break is. Nab. Nagari. Close. Yaburi. Yaburi. What does isoide mean? Isoide is a. It's quickly, I believe. Yep, it is quickly. How about harigane? What does that mean? Harigane is. Money, the but No, no. Mm, money is a good metal. guess, but. Yes, it is. It's a type of metal. And hari means needle. So we have the word needle and metal, which does not have anything really to do with needles, but any idea what it might mean? It's a lockpick. 
It is a lockpick. It is, it is wires. How about a Joma Yaburi? What is a Joma Yaburi? Joma Yaburi. Breaking. It's a breaking of, of locks. Yes, it's breaking lock picking. In. It is a lock pick or to begin picking a lock. So here it is, um, tonikakata, to start. So I start picking the lock of the door. Um, so it means both a lock pick and to pick a lock as a noun. Um, can you read this word for me? Um, Kingaku. Hi, Gin Kingaku <laughs> is an amount of money. Kingaku. So now you get to go read our last line of the day. Hi. Um Iwareta Kingaku o Sasato Harai. Boro fuku kara atsu te no atsu de no fuku ni kigae te kutsu himo o shime. Um, Kata bakari no koto no pocket ni. Knife to Joe my a sorry, what was breaking again, mommy? Uh, yeah, but yeah, but yeah, but no, Harry Garne or to succumb to uh, isoy de. Ten o, oh, not ten. Nise o, oh, yo bi dashita. Perfect. Iwareta kingaku o sato harai. Sato, right away. Hai. Harai is to buy. To pay. From harau. To Hai. pay. To swipe. To so. sweep. I pay right away. Kingaku, one more time. What is the kingaku money? The An cost. amount of money. An amount of money. Kingaku o iwareta. The amount that was, that I heard. Hi, that I was the told. That, that was, that I was told. Um, and boro is worn out clothing. So, boro fuku kara from out of worn clothes. Atsude no fuku ni kigaete. I changed into thick clothing. Hi. And kutsuhimo o shime, I tie the, the sue strings. Perfect. From shimeru is to tie that one. Hi. Um, and kata bakari no koto no pocketo ni into the pocket of the coat which I have just bought. Kata bakari no that I've just bought. Um, I I sukomu which is um I I stuff it in. Right, Mani? Su Hi. Su su komu is komu, and the other action is um, su suki as in stabbing. Yep. Or, no, was it suki? Or it's suku to stab. To stab. Hi. So I stuff it into the pocket. Now I stuff the harigane, the lockpick that was used for lock breaking. Jomae. Yaburi. And I put the knife in as well. Knife here. Hi. 
uh, isoide and quick and quickly mise o tobi dashita. So this is dasu from to leave to go out of. Hi, to fly out, fly out, out to of the leap, the jump, the run out. I, I run out. Hi. Perfect. Well, Khan is brilliant. <laughs> a very smart kid. He managed to get his hand on the knife without even asking Nebody for it. I think he's he had the knife on him. The... Nebody... Oh, you're right. It was the, the I, doll I think... knife. You're right. It was that doll knife that nobody was like, eh, can't use this anymore. That was old Cloudy, the silver he knife. You're ten... right. <laughs> he, did, he, did, he, didn't he didn't explicitly ask for it. He just so, so. He just noticed it, that he was tossing it away.